Hello everyone, this is Game Galaxy Zone. Welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario 64. In the previous episode, we beated Crystal Palace and the Crystal King, aka the Ice King, and um, retrieved the last Star Spirit so we can move on to the final level of the game. But, however, there is multiple things that have yet to be done before the end of the game. Uh, one, as you notice, I'm only level 18, so I did not get to level 30, and I don't think I will. I have to finish these videos today, so there's going to be a lot of work going on. Uh, first off, if I level up anymore, I've maxed out my badge points. Uh, so the next thing that's going to be upgraded would be my flower points and heart points, but probably FP is going to be the biggest thing. So that's that. In today's episode, we are going to be doing the badge hunt. I did say I would collect all the badges within the game, which I've never done. and. Um, turns out there's a lot of badges that I have yet to even pick up, so this might be a good hour and a half today to look for the rest of them. So there's one more badge located inside of Crystal Palace that I did not pick up, and because I'm already here, I might as well get it, right? And that is Triple Dip, which is an item that allows you to use three items at one time. Uh, not entirely worth it, but I do believe it is right here, this chest we missed. Yep. During battle, let's use three items during one turn. That's pretty good. Uh... I might be using that, maybe, maybe not, during the final battle, so. So now we have to move on to the next item, so there's going to be a ton of cutting in this episode today, so sorry for that, but I'll meet you at the next badge. And I might as well figure uh, to show this as well the opposite side of this wall here, which has a star piece in it, and now I remember exactly what these are for. We're going to be getting a lot of badges with star pieces, and unfortunately I only have 14, and I do believe I need about 30 of them, so it's going to be a lot of hunting for those things as well. So anyway, on to the next badge. I should also mention really quick that uh, I have yet to go and get any of the last remaining upgrade blocks, so we're probably going to do that today as well. Sorry, didn't mean to stop there. Okay, so... Our next badge is from this guy. We have to buy from him two more times here to actually get this badge. Um, it requires a lot of coins though, which really sucks. So, here we got a life shroom. Really good, because I'm going to be needing those. And... On this item is going to be the badge. And this is Bump Attack. It lets Mario destroy a weaker enemy in the field by hitting it. So, I can take out some simple, weak enemies that don't, like, give me a whole lot of star coins anymore. So, unfortunately that lowered my coins to below 100 now, so I won't be able to buy a lot from the shop. And there's a lot of badges that we can still buy from the shop, including dual badges, like, some we've already have. So, uh, like, this is new at the moment. Oh, cool. Yeah, we need to... We need to get these. We need to absolutely get these. So... Actually, we can buy one now. And I think I'm gonna buy this one. Okay. So, now we can't buy any of those. So now we just acquired two... Three new badges today. And that would be this one, and a few others. I did equip this for right now. Doesn't seem like it really did much, but whatever. Bump attack. It's a lot of BP to use it, though. So anyway, on to the next badge.
Alright, so if we talk to the younger brother in uh, shooting Star Summit, he'll give you badges for trading in the star pieces. And as you can see, there's a lot of badges. Also, I didn't realize this, but there's Power Plus. This is an absolute, I need to buy this. And this is increases Mario's jump and its hammer attack powers by one. So it's just as good as the defense thing. Plus, it'll increase with the P up, P down, so it'll bring it back to almost normal level. And increase my defense again, which is great, because my defense is horrible. But um, as you can see here, this requires 50, and then 70. So right now, we are currently at 15. It would take eons to get that many star pieces. Um, I don't know how I'm going to do it, but in order for me to acquire all the badges, I know some of these badges you can actually find, I do believe. Like, the Happy Hearts thing, we've already found this. But, it's, it's going to take a lot. So the first one that I need to buy here, hold on, because I'm doing like a giant list, would be Chill Out, which is towards the top, I do believe. Yeah. So Chill Out would be the first one that we'd need to buy here. But, hmm. you know what, I'm doing this list, I'm gonna go straight down the list, so I might as well buy it. Alright, so we got Chill Out. Okay, so we'll be coming back here quite a lot. <laughs> okay. Damn. Um. So this exists. Shoot, I didn't know. Duh, what? Okay, I'll take that. What's. Oh! Uh, what? I didn't even know this was... Hmm. Okay. So, uh, I could've just... I'm an idiot. I ain't saying it, because the last time I went da na 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 the freaking power went off. Okay, I'm assuming this is what they're talking about. Um, yep. So, that's how you get this trolley little badge. Also, I need to go back up there to get the star piece.
I'm gonna get this for now, because I definitely would like it. How many more do I have? That's a thing? God damn, if I would have known about that about, you know, the beginning of the episode, I would have done that. Alright you guys, so with all the badges, I don't know, I'm probably not going to get them all today, unfortunately, because this video is already about 40 minutes long, and there's a lot of cutting in it, but even still, it's very long. Um, so, I'm going to be getting the last, like, two badges for now. The remaining badges that I technically need, with the exception of maybe, like, one or two, are from the shop, which are about all over $100. Actually, this is the one that we're going to get right now. Um, super charge. Super smash charge. So, uh, but we're going to get the jump version of it, because I missed it, I guess. And we're also going to get power... Whatever that thing was that Morlo was selling to us for star coins. So we're going to pick that up today as well. Okay, I thought I missed this here, but I didn't think I did. Alright, so this video also will include Anti-Shy Guy. I was not expecting to do Anti-Shy Guy, um, but that's what the Power Plus badge is. So I don't have a choice. I am probably going to regret this. Alright, so this is Anti-Shy Guy Challenge. Anti-Shy Guy is unbelievably hard and annoying. I don't know if I'll be able to kill him. Hopefully I won't die, because his attacks normally are like 8. So... So I'm definitely doing that. And as you can see, he missed. So I'm gonna do this one more time. So it requires a lot of FP. And now let's beat him in the head. He has no defense, good. Oh, that still happened, okay. Holy butts and balls. 14 damage, sweet. This is not easy, let me tell you, trying to kill him. Man, am I so freaking lucky. Alright, I'm gonna do that again. It's a lot of FP. Okay. It's so worrying when you see him go to attack and it's...
Yes! Oh, thank Christ! I thought for sure I would have died from anti-shy guy. I only got hit once, thank God. Oh, okay. So, we got the Power Plus badge. So, we can get two of these, technically. And I'm probably going to buy the other one. So, well, I have no choice. I have to get all the badges. But, um, that's my choice on getting double the badges. But anyway... Holy crap, I was not expecting to face Anti-Shy Guy till the end of the episode. Uh, oh well. Also, this keeps saying there's a fucking... Oh, here it is. Thank you. Needed that. I'm gonna need a lot of those. Okay, so that wasn't as painful as I thought it would be, but um... About 90% of the remaining badges are from Ralph's shop, and also from Merloin. So I'm gonna need to get... If I'm gonna get the ones from Merloin, I'm gonna need to collect... Holy crap, about 50? No. It might be about 100 star pieces. And I still need to complete Chapter 8 today, and I'm already ahead like, behind schedule. So, I think I'm gonna do that. So we'll get the remaining badges in a later day. I'll record an episode for you guys where I'm getting... I'll either show off all the badges, or I'll do this again and I'll show off where the badges are located and how to get them and whatnot. But, um, that won't be for another day, because I don't have the coins to get stuff like that right now. And it's it's mass chaos, so I'll probably do that on a later day. So I will see you guys in the next episode.